In this lesson, we're going to review compound loci. This is very similar to regular locus, except there is more than one um, condition that we have to meet. So, for example, we may have a, a line, and I'll just call this line K, and a point on this line, we'll say point P. And the compound loci might be, uh, we need a, the locus of points that are four inches from point P. And also two inches from line R, line K. So we do this the same way we do other ones. We just uh, look at one uh, the condition at a time. So we'll look at this condition first, four inches from point P. And then we'll look at the condition two inches from line K. And then we'll just determine what points satisfy both of them. So four inches from point P will just be a circle centered at P with a radius of four. So we just have that this radius here is four inches. So then lines that are two inches from K be a line above K and below K with a distance of two inches from it. So it looks something like this. So we have a line above and a line below. And just remember that when we plot or uh, sketch the locus, it should be a dashed line. So I'm just going to erase some of these here. So this is uh, my dashed circle. This is my original line, line K. So here's my uh, locus uh, two inches from line K. Just make this dashed, make this dashed. So now we have this circle which represents four inches from point P and these two lines which represent two inches from line K. But we're looking for the points that are both four inches from point P and also two inches from line K. So now we, that we see where are all the points that are two inches from line K and four inches from P just look for the points that satisfy both conditions. So that would be this condition here, we'll just mark with an X. This spot satisfies both. Here and also here. So in determining compound loci, what we want to do is take a look at each condition individually and sketch it and just find the points where they intersect. And that will tell us um, our actual solution which just satisfies both conditions.